Um, I don't think we're the. I don't, I don't think at any point tonight I thought we were could be the team that I think we're going to be. Uh, I, I feel like we are going to be a better basketball team before this is all said and done. You, obviously, you know, with Elaine's situation, it's only her second game. I mean, hello. So there's a there's a lot of season left for her and then for the size. We need Elaine's size, obviously, um, to go against these bigger schools. We can't go with a front line of 5'9", 6 foot, 6'1", six 6'2", six Parker being, we list her at 6'2", I don't even know if Parker's a legitimate 6'2". We're small, you know, we need that kind of size and we need that kind of skill set to go against the Maryland's, the Penn State's, and the bigger teams. That's the reality of the situation. I love my team, I love their heart, but when you go to the next level, we are a mid-major school, and when you go to the next level, the next level, the Maryland's, the Kansas's, the Penn State's, they are huge. They are 6'6", six, 6'4", six, 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 and you got to be able to combat that with taking good shots and, you know, obviously executing. And tonight we didn't do that in the second half of the game. Considering that Elena was off for a month, did you get what you were expecting from her tonight? Um, I think that Elena gave everything that she could, just like everybody else. Um, it's really hard to be off for a long time and have your timing back. She got into a little bit of rhythm in the second half, but when you're off a month, it, I, I, I would say to anybody here, don't do anything for a month and then come out and try to play a basketball game. It's not easy um, to continue to try to become a better basketball team. We are a work in progress. But I thought Elena gave effort. I thought our team gave effort. We just could not control them on the boards, and I don't think there's many teams in the country, with the exception of maybe the top five teams in the country, that can hang with Maryland on the board in the here and now. And right now, Maryland is the ninth ranked team in the country. They're a very good basketball team. We're still trying to find our way. So um, to answer that question, she's not 100%. We stay in the here and now, and no, we cannot beat Maryland. They just beat us on our home floor, and they played better than we did, and they rebounded the basketball.